Good evening. Tonight, the family of the UNM student killed on campus Saturday is demanding answers. Brandon Travis's parents say their son should have been flying home for Thanksgiving this week. Instead, they're planning his funeral. They want to know why police didn't intervene when they had the chance weeks before. Investigators say their son was involved in a shootout. Respected, well-mannered, and helpful. That's how Brandon Travis's family describe him in a statement tonight. They say their son has many accolades and accomplishments. The 19-year-old was a 2021 graduate from Inglewood High School in California, where he played football. His parents say he came to UNM in August on an academic scholarship. He was also a member of the student organization Brothers Leading and Cultivating Knowledge, which supports African-American men in their academic, personal, and professional pursuits through volunteerism and community engagement. His family stating his death could have been prevented. They blame a fight at the NMSU UNM game in Las Cruces last month involving Travis and NMSU basketball player Mike Peak. The Travis family says the viral video shows Travis in the fetal position, repeatedly kicked and punched. While standing nearby, an officer did not do enough to stop the attack. NMSU leadership today saying they saw the video about a week after it happened and passed it on to campus police. Clearly, we did not necessarily think that that video um, or the fight was particularly um, significant. Um, obviously, hindsight is 2020. What I meant by that was it was not addressed by the, the police at that time. There was no case number. There was no arrest. There was nothing um, to that degree. A little more than a month after this fight, police say Travis and three others lured Peak to the UNM campus to jump him, seeking revenge. Police say Travis shot at Peak and Peak returned fire, killing Travis. Now in the video, it appears the officer may be with state police. We have reached out to state police to confirm and they say they're looking into it.